Today's video is going to be a short one, but it's going to be an important one. I don't want you guys to make the same mistake as me. I bought the wrong capture card. Now, if you don't know what a capture card is, it's what I use to connect my Xbox to my computer and start streaming from. So the company we're going to be talking about is Elgato. Now, Elgato makes a bunch of different types of, you know, products, but we're going to be talking about the capture cards. Now, if you go to Elgato's website, it's going to tell you that the only capture card that works with Apple products is the Elgato HD60S Plus. I made completely horrible mistake. I bought the HD60 S, I believe, and it did not work at all on my MacBook. It would somewhat pop up, but I would get delays and the audio would get out of sync very easily. It was just a big hassle, so I had to return that one. I actually put Windows on my MacBook and it worked fine, but it just wasn't good enough, the quality. I obviously want to just use my Mac as a Mac. I don't want to use my Mac as a Windows computer. So I went with the HD60 Plus and the delay went away. I could stream off of it perfectly. Dude. Be careful and do the research. It has an HDMI in, HDMI out, super easy to connect. It has a USB port actually to connect to the computer. What you need to do is if you want it to be USB-C to USB-C instead of using a dongle, I'm gonna leave a link to an anchor cable that I use and it works perfectly fine with this product. There is absolutely no delay. You can use this on Xbox, you can use this with a Switch, you can use this with a PlayStation and you will have no problems. So don't be like me, get the HD60S Plus. If you guys wanna see how to set it up in depth, I will do that. Just leave me a like and comment down below. But as far as capture cards that work, this is the one. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.